Ligerstremia indica, the crepe myrtle is a species of flowering plant in the genus Ligerstremia of the family Lithraceae. It is native to the Indian subcontinent, and also to Southeast Asia, China, Korea, and Japan. The genus name honors Swedish botanist Magnus von Lagerström. It is an often multi-stemmed, deciduous tree with a wide-spreading, flat-topped, rounded, or even spike-shaped open habit. The tree is a popular nesting shrub for songbirds and wrens. In the United Kingdom, Lagerstremia indica has gained the Royal Horticultural Society's Award of Garden Merit. Crepe myrtle blooming near the United States capital inflorescence the bark is thin and about 2 mm. Thick, smooth, pinkish-gray and mottled, shedding each year. Leaves also shed each winter, after spectacular color display, and bare branches relief early in the spring. Leaves are small, smooth-edged, circular or oval-shaped, and dark green changing to yellow and orange and red in autumn. Flowers, on different trees, are white, pink, mauve, purple or carmin with crimped petals, in panicles up to 9 cm. Flowers give way to six-capsuled, round dehiscent fruits. In the United States, Lagerstremia indica is a very popular flowering shrub slash small tree in mild winter states. Low maintenance needs make it a common municipal planting in parks, along sidewalks, highway medians and in parking lots. Like the southern magnolia, the crepe myrtle has come to symbolize the American South because of its extensive planting and ability to thrive in hot, humid summer climates with regular precipitation. It is one of only a few trees shrubs to offer brilliant color in late summer through autumn, at a time when many flowering plants have exhausted their blooms. In arid climates, it requires supplemental watering and some shade in the very hottest areas. The plant must have hot summers in order to flower successfully, otherwise it will show weak bloom and is more vulnerable to fungal diseases. Frequently L. indica is root hardy to zone 5, meaning it will be killed back during harsh winters but regrow from the roots and flower in summer. As such northern gardeners treat it more like a perennial than a tree or shrub. Too much watering and over-fertilizing can decrease the cold hardiness because it stimulates new growth late in the season that does not have time to harden off. Ligerstremia indica is frost-tolerant, prefers full sun and will grow to 6 meters with a spread of 6 meters. The plant is not picky about soil type but does require good drainage to thrive. Once established it is also quite drought-hardy, though it benefits from the occasional deep watering during the summer months. Fifteen hybrid cultivars have been developed between L. indica and L. fourier by the U.S. National Arboretum for increased cold hardiness and resistance to disease, all given the names of Native American tribes. There are also dwarf cultivars of indica times fourier crossbreeds and regular L. indica species, which grow 2 to 5 feet. Lagerstremia is a common planting in South Atlantic states and is becoming an increasingly common shrub in mid-Atlantic states all the way up through the coastal areas of Massachusetts. Ligerstremia also thrives in the Mediterranean and desert climates of Southern California, Arizona and Nevada, and also in Australia as a street plant. In the southern U.S. mildew and fungal diseases have traditionally posed problems for L. indica. This was a major motivation for developing the L. indica times L. fourier hybrids, which show increased resistance to powdery mildew and fungus. The fungal pathogen Circuspora lithraceorum can infest the plant in summer during hot, rainy weather and cause premature leaf drop. Gardeners plant resistant hybrid varieties or use fungicide sprays to help control this. Insect problems with Lagerstremia indica include the crepe myrtle aphid, Tinocallus kahawala wokalani, which can cause yellow spots and black mold, Japanese beetles, and the flea beetle. None of these insects are fatal to the plant and other predator insects are usually enough to resolve infestations, however applications of insecticidal soap can also be helpful. During the winter, Gardeners will often lop off the branches of large specimens, to manage size and encourage more profuse summer bloom. This is colloquially known as crepe murder because of the drastic pruning involved, leaving a bare trunk during the winter and early spring. Tree topping of crepe myrtles is a common occurrence but is not recommended nor endorsed by many professional standards or arboricultural organizations. In 1983, Hinako Sugiruwa started a manga series titled Sarusuberi, after the Japanese name of the plant. Sugiruwa compared the flowering season of L. indica, that keeps blooming and dropping flowers at the same time, with the vigor of ukiyo-e art, the setting of the manga. Thanks for watching.